Hey guys, Paul here with REO Auction Academy, and I'm gonna go over a sample deal, recent deal that just closed, we just sold yesterday. And give you an idea how long it takes, basically from beginning and from the bidding process to the acquisition, to the rehab, to the resale. And this is a really lengthy one in this case, and this isn't the norm, but it can take this long. So I just wanna give you an idea. So this property is originally put out in the market in March of 2017. I was bidding it then, bid it all during 2018 and um, 2019. And did finally get the bid accepted at, I wanna say around the early November, middle of November of 2019 of last year. And as you can see, it was, it was originally overpriced. The property needed work was listed at 129.5, which is basically market value at that point. I was able to pick it up for $55,000, as you can see here, on December 12th last year. And how I was able to go about doing it, basically, I was just bidding like crazy, right? Bidding on HUD Home Store, then when I went to auction.com, bid there. Then I believe it went to Zoom, and I bid there, and then it ended up ultimately back at the HUD Home Store, where, again, I bid it, and finally, they accepted the bid. And here is the end product. With this property, because there wasn't a whole lot of inventory available, I did more of a wholesale on this than I did a rehab or it's kind of like a half scale rehab. Full scale rehab, I would have painted and stained the whole deck as well here. As you can see, it's just the house that we hit here. We didn't do anything with the deck, kind of left that as is. And, you know, cleaned it up a little bit. We didn't even pressure wash the uh, concrete. The yard is what it is. What we did do was put laminate flooring in. We um, also painted the entire interior, put new ceiling fans in, fixtures in, new um, doorknobs as needed, and maybe a few new baseboard heaters, new carpet, <clears throat> new light strip, no vinyl planking, new toilets, new faucets for the vanities. Uh, we were able to keep the existing showers, which was great. In the, in the basement, we turned this into the full uh, laundry room setup with the hot water heater. And we also have another area here where we install laminate flooring, um, put in some basically uh, just wood groove uh, planking for the walls. Same with the lower portion down here. This room is all molded up in the past. Um, water had gotten through and it's just all molded up down in this area. We put a new kitchen here. This is a basic white shaker Lowe's kitchen, inexpensive. It was probably around $1,200 to $1,300 for the cabinetry. Then I put granite in, so that ran another $1,500, and then appliances. And here's some of the, these are actually, I think these are 12 by 24 vinyl stick um, flooring tiles, and you don't have to grout these. This makes it look like granite. Actually, they look fantastic and are pretty durable. Use those quite a bit. Wouldn't even put a new um, enclosure onto the fireplace here. We left that as is. So we put on the market, it sold quickly for 135 cash buyer. Just closed on it yesterday. Give you some more pictures here to look at. Yeah, had some basic nice features to it here. You know, I have parking up here, walking to it down here. And uh, we're able to net $42,000 was our bottom line net profit after paying a private lender, paying a realtor the 5% and closing cost. So good example deal. Um, we did get bogged down a little bit during the coronavirus time where we had to stop work for a little while until the contractor was able to come back out there again. So we lost about a month and a half or so. But um, 42,000 can't beat that. So that's a perfect example of what you can find here. At REO Auction Academy, we teach you how to find deals like this and also how to rehab it, even if you're out of town. If you're interested in finding out more, you know, reach out to us at reoauctionacademy.com. And uh, do me a favor, if you like this video, you know, click the thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel. We appreciate it and we'll hopefully have more videos from, for you in a future like this. Thanks.